A man with an assault rifle goes on a rampage, firing shots inside a mobile home park with families and children before he was brought down in a shootout with police. 10 News reporter Anthony Pura is live in San Isidro, where residents of this mobile home park are finally being allowed back in. Anthony? Well, investigators have left the scene. They were here for nearly eight hours processing the scene here inside this mobile home park off Willow Road. Tonight, they are not releasing the suspect's name, but they are confirming he was a resident here. Mayhem in a mobile home park. Families in a frenzy as a man walked through armed with an AK-47 style rifle, firing off several rounds. It looked like something was wrong with him. He was hiding behind cars. Vanessa White says her sister went outside to investigate and got a good look at him. When they met eyes, he looked like he was on drugs or something because he was just like making a crazy face. She and her family hid inside a room and locked the door. And we just waited to, to everything to calm down and we heard like six gunshots and then um, we were like scared, like do not go outside. When they came out of hiding, they saw the man dead on the ground. Police say they ordered the suspect to put the gun down, but instead he turned his rifle towards them. An officer opened fire, shooting the suspect. They tried to keep him alive, but he died on scene. Before the suspect was shot by police, this woman, who didn't want her face shown, says the gunman spoke to her, but made no sense. I see this man coming with a big shot, and he told me, I, was, I told him because I got nervous, what's up? He said, oh, I just killed the because I have a problem with the Ariano. And then he probably walked like three feet and then the police come and shot him. Police are not releasing the suspect's name, but say the 50 year old lived in the mobile home park. Some neighbors say they had seen him around. He seemed normal then. This time it was not the case. Because he didn't look right in the head and just acting sketchy. Now, police are not naming the officer who shot the suspect tonight, but they are saying he was a two and a half year veteran of the department. We're reporting live in San Isidro, Anthony Pura, 10 News. Thank you, Anthony.